Hey, it's Jonas with Classic Outdoors, and today we're gonna dive into some of the coolest hybrid solo canoes that are in the industry. Looking forward to showing them to you. The Old Town Discovery 119 is by far one of the most user-friendly, robust, solid solo canoes in the industry. That's budget-friendly. Anybody can buy it, but it gives you an awesome feeling. It's a really great kayak. Old Town has brought us this boat in a simple package that's weighing just under 60 pounds at 56 pounds. It's very simply uh, outfitted. We've got two thwarts, end caps, front and back. Obviously, our solo seat. With over a century of producing canoes, Old Town has brought us this cool little package that's gonna keep us on the water for entry-level people or just somebody that's wanting to have something simply for fishing, hunting, touring. This is an awesome canoe for us to have in our, in our lineup. Here we have a GCI sit-backer equipped on here. This is gonna give us some backrest support if we're wanting it. Uh, GCI has developed this seat. It's got its portage lock on here so that way when you go to lift the boat up, flip it upside down, that backrest is held. Nice little tackle box or snack holder there on the side. And it's off and on. Two clips. Now I can take it to the ball game. The one thing we found with the Old Town boat with the GCI sitbacker, the seat height is actually perfect. But if you're a real true solo canoeist and you're wanting to kneel and paddle, this seat is hung too low. Simply grab some hockey sticks or a little blocking, get some new fasteners from your local fastener store. You can lift that seat up and now that seat will be at a better position for you to kneel and paddle. Our good friends over at Scotty have produced some incredible little bolt-on parts that we can put on any boat. But of course here we have our combing thwart mount partnered up with a, a bait caster spinning rod reel. Or you can swap it out, get your cup holder, and now you can take your favorite beverage with you. All sorts of cool little hooks where you can hang your fishing lures on there or your GPS. And it's a great day on the water. When Old Town gave us the next, we were super excited. We had this boat that was a hybrid between a canoe and a kayak. It gave us the ease of paddling that a kayak would with a nice backrest and seat system on it, foot braces built in. It gave us the great packability of a canoe with the comfort of a kayak seat and foot braces in here. This boat is built to be paddled primarily with your double bladed kayak paddle, but it's giving you that great portageability that we need up in the Canadian North where we're moving from lake to lake and river to river. Old Town started to pack features into their kayaks that we hadn't seen before. Just something simple like a little storage shelf right here for our tackle boxes and everyday essentials that we might want to have with us. They gave us a sliding seat that we could easily adjust the trim of the kayak based on where the wind angle would be coming from or what we had loaded in our boat. Old Town also gave us the option to be able to pop our seat out so that way if we're getting to our campsite and we're wanting to have a chair with us, pull out the four pins and now we've got a great seat for on the ground. One other feature Old Town didn't fail to give us is a great little storage spot right here behind us. This guy has a drain hole in it, blows up to being able to hold some substantial equipment. You could have your first aid, you could have your raincoat, whatever you're thinking you might want to have close at hand just behind you. The Old Town Next has got it built into their seat. What an awesome kayak. With a little more fisherman minded, Old Town came out with the Sportsman 119. This kayak came to us with a great seat. It's got some little padding right here for our elbows for often when you're fishing, holding your paddle, just daydreaming like how often we do. It gives a little added comfort to the kayak. It's equipped with a cup holder right between our legs. Behind the seat, Old Town's equipped this boat with some flush mounts for an added fishing rod or your net. And it's placed in a perfect spot. Right beside us, Old Town has given us some little trays where we can have equipped our pliers, little fishing tackle, something we might want to have close at hand. Moving forward, Old Town has equipped their awesome gear track. We can mount any of our Scotty, Ram, Yak Attack equipment up in front, keeping our gear, cameras, whatever we're wanting to have close at hand, but not in the path of our paddle. What a great kayak. 
So to sum up these three boats, if you're looking for a great solo canoe, if you're maybe not confident with a canoe paddle and you're looking for something that'll still help you to get to different waterways, Old Town has some great economical kayaks that'll do the job for you. Whether you're paddling through class two or three rapids, we've equipped these boats with spray decks from North Water and they work great. Or if you're just looking to leisurely paddle and take some photos of the loons at the lake, Old Town has these three options right here and we know that you'll be happy with any of them. Thank you for paddling with us today and we look forward to showing you boats again next time.